on the descent through the upgraded route. Hey you guys, welcome back and welcome to Mo's Life in a Bag and welcome back to a brand new video. If you are new here, go ahead and press the subscribe button, click the notification bell so that you can be notified whenever I post a brand new video here on my channel. And if you are already a part of the crew, thank you so much for returning. Today is Friday, April the 22nd. So as some of you may know, for all air travel, the mask mandate has been lifted. Customers that are flying on the airplanes are not required to wear their masks. Passengers that are going through airports are not required to wear their masks. I mean, it just is a mask free world right now, y'all. Yes, I am currently in the airport. As you guys saw, I commuted in this morning. Got to Dallas around about 10 o'clock. I am getting ready to start my trip and we depart at 2.49, I think. Now it's 2.02. .02. Standing right across from my gate, incoming flight just landed. So they're deplaning right now. I am position one on this trip. So y'all already know how that goes but it's a little different now because we are back completely full service on board the aircraft y'all like in first class full meal service alcohol in the main cabin and you know what y'all i know y'all probably like well if the mask mandate was lifted monique why are you wearing your mask honestly y'all i can like insert <laughs> a tiktok that i did when i did fly without my mask and honestly, I was just uncomfortable. Like, you know, like I felt naked, honestly. So, if you don't follow me on TikTok, go follow me on TikTok at Monique R. Voice. All of my links to my social media are down in my description box below. So, y'all go check me out on TikTok. I am starting a three day trip. We fly from Dallas to JFK. JFK to Boston, we lay over there. Tomorrow we do Boston to Miami, Miami to Detroit. We lay over in Detroit. And then on the last day, we have one leg home from Detroit back to Dallas. But I decided that I would vlog for you guys. This has been a couple weeks and we have had major changes like lifting the mask mandate, y'all. A bunch of people in the airport right now are not wearing masks and on the plane and like i said i tried it I, I i didn't just you know be like oh i'm i'm still you know i flew without my mask i just didn't feel comfortable and i just want to feel comfortable so i'm gonna keep mine on for now yet i would vlog for you guys because it's been so long since we have talked and so many things have happened i feel like in the last couple weeks as you guys can see i don't know if you guys have noticed but your girl has hit 1,000 subscribers and I'm so excited about that and I just want to shout out all of you guys for supporting me watching my videos hitting the subscribe button hitting the like button leaving me comments down below y'all know that I appreciate it so much and I love you guys so much this will actually be my very first trip with the mask mandate being lifted people are so happy like I said I don't really know how I feel about it I don't really know how long it's actually going to last, you know, with people not having to wear their mask in the airport or airplane. But if you are traveling right now, just be careful y'all because <laughs> it's real out here with people not wearing their masks. The use of face coverings on our aircraft is optional. We ask that whether you choose to wear a face mask or not, that you please respect your fellow passengers and crew members' decisions. We're coming through the aisle now for our final safety checks. Sit back, relax, and enjoy your flight. I have started my service up here in first class. We have meals. I've already taken them, their drinks, and I took them warm nuts. So I'm gonna show y'all that. 
So it's like a legit oven that we have on board, y'all. These are the ovens. And then I just have some extra warm nuts for the people who didn't want any. Get ready to show y'all the options. It's two different salads. One of them is a vegetarian option and the other one is protein, which is shrimp. So I'm gonna show y'all that. So this right here is the vegetarian salad. It's got potatoes, boiled eggs, tomatoes, and asparagus. Comes with a side of rice and then a little cake right there for dessert. This right here is the protein salad. So as you guys can see, it's got the shrimp on there, cheese, corn, tomatoes, and the same side and the same dessert. So these are the two options that they have to choose from to eat today. so we are in JFK we just got on our new aircraft that we are taking to Boston and it's much bigger than the other aircrafts that we usually fly on and that is because we are flying out of New York y'all New York has some really nice big airplanes this is a transcon and it's real fancy y'all this is real cute so we have officially started boarding and i will see you guys when we get to boston good morning y'all it is the very next day i didn't close out last night because honestly i was just really tired y'all already know that your girl is a commuter and so flying in from memphis like early in the morning to dallas sitting in the airport all day because our sign-in wasn't until like 1 40 we didn't depart till like 2 40 because our sign-in is an hour before departure it was just a long day y'all yesterday we did dallas jfk jfk boston so that is where i am at currently right now and i am gonna give you guys a little room tour very quickly because i actually am about to head downstairs and go to the gym i'm really excited because our pickup isn't until let's see they wrote it down on this paper for us actually when we checked in our pickup isn't until 1 47 p.m right now it is 11 18 so i said that's perfect i can sleep in a little bit out the bed got dressed and ready to go get a little workout in so i probably do like maybe 30 minutes or i don't know maybe an hour in the gym come back up here by the time i'm back up here it'll probably be around like 12 30 ish maybe eat some lunch because i have let me show you guys what i packed for my lunch for this trip i'll be packing my food y'all i'm trying y'all know that your girl is trying to lose weight and so i packed my food for this trip so for lunch i actually have salads that i packed i ate one yesterday and i have two more left because this is a three-day trip so i count for day one today which is day two and then tomorrow i have a salad so i'm gonna come back upstairs and after my workout eat my lunch and then it should be time to head out y'all today we are going from jfk to miami and then miami to detroit and we lay over in detroit tonight so today honestly is probably going to be a bit of a long day because from boston to miami that's probably going to be like a three-hour flight and then from miami to detroit it's probably going to be like a three-hour flight so oh y'all but please go down in the comment section below and let me know what y'all really think about this no masks thing in the airport and on the airplane y'all because i'm just I don't know i have like mixed feelings like today i woke up feeling a bit more refreshed like i kind of feel like doing maybe just a little bit of makeup you know get in like just semi cute today but then i'm like you know i'm still gonna have my mask on because as y'all know i'm still gonna be wearing my mask so i'm just like y'all please go down below and let me know what y'all think what are y'all gonna be doing when y'all travel like are y'all gonna be wearing y'all mask and then i said well you know what maybe i'll just 
wear it on the plane and not wear it while I'm walking through the airport, you know, because it's more space. But y'all know on the plane, it's recycled air. It's just recycled air. It's no fresh air. So that's just my biggest thing. Y'all go down below and let me know. I am about to head out and go to the gym. I had to call. I'm going to get my cold water, actually. I have a water in the fridge. I have two waters that are sitting out, but... I have one that I put in the fridge as well. So I'm gonna get my water, AirPods, room key, cause I need that to get into the gym. So I'm about to get this workout in. Y'all, I am literally, what time is it? It's 1.31, pickup is at 1.47. I told y'all that earlier. So I need to be downstairs and I'm upstairs, running freaking behind per usual. Here I my face, y'all, because when you be on the plane and all that recycled air, it just dries out your skin. Okay. Put my ring on. This is my tablet. So <laughs> I really had to get I really had to get my bearings. Y'all see that? Y'all see that? Okay, I got my bearings. I got my freaking I'm ready. I'm ready to go. Okay. Let's see what time it is right now. Right now it's 134. So I'm like perfect. I want to I like to be downstairs at least 10 minutes before pickup. So I want to get downstairs at 137 because pickup is at 147. So we good on time. Okay. It's not gonna take me more than three minutes to get down the elevator. I am dressed and ready. And I know some of y'all probably y'all not gonna say nothing in the comments, or maybe y'all will. But I know some of y'all probably like, dang, like how come Monique only wears the same uniform all the time and if you haven't noticed that and if you're not talking about it i'm just gonna bring attention to it because i'm holding myself accountable to lose weight y'all this is my uniform that i am the most comfortable in right now as far as like comfortability goes and i'm trying to make changes in my life right now y'all and losing weight and being healthier is one of them Okay, oh, I forgot I have to show y'all my room. Let me give y'all a little tour. I'm gonna give y'all a little tour. I'm gonna give y'all a little tour. Hold on. We're gonna do a little tour. We're gonna do a little tour. Here's the bed. I always give y'all a tour of my room. You know what I noticed? This lamp over here, it looks like that. And then this lamp over here looks like this. Why? You know, that's weird to me. And then this thing over here, like this is weird to me. Like, what is this? I don't know if it's supposed to like, like, I don't know, you know, I don't know what's going on, but we got a nice little couch right here. This is really cute, y'all. I love this. My view, this is my view of Boston, y'all, which ugh, I love Boston. Boston, honestly, is so nice. Oh, I love it here. And this little area over here has to be my absolute favorite. I love what they did with the decor on the wall over here. First of all, this picture frame, bomb, okay? This is bomb, this is really cute. This table right here, super duper cute. The chair is very sleek, all black, really cute. The lamp and the lights over here are really cute, which I never even figured out how to turn on these lights. I don't, see to me, that's not the way. knocking on my door to clean my room you know what that's my cue let me put my glasses on let me show y'all real quick the bathroom this is the bathroom okay i took me a shower when i got back from the gym and i didn't even get to eat my salad y'all because i ran i just was running 
running like not really good on time so i didn't get a chance to eat my salad so i'm just eating my salad on the plane i am fixing to head downstairs this is like the second time that they have knocked on my door so i know they're really trying to come in here and clean up so i'll see y'all later We're glad you're here. This flight is on its way to one of our many destinations across the globe. This whole day, because we have one leg tomorrow to Dallas. So you're at the show, whatever we're filming here. We just got to Miami, and y'all know this airport is on 10 right now, as always. But we're sitting right across from our gate for our flight to Detroit. So we're just about to chill probably grab something to eat we have a couple hours before we leave here and then we're not supposed to get to Detroit till probably around like 11 30 so it's gonna be really late when I get in tonight y'all so I am in Detroit we landed in Detroit and so y'all will not believe what just happened to me as y'all can see I'm by myself my crew is not with me right now and like I said, we just got to Detroit. We get all the way out of security, y'all. And I realized that I don't have my phone or my tablet. <laughs> and I'm just like, oh my gosh. And I was like looking for my phone or something. I realized I didn't have it. So I had to come all the way back through security, y'all. KCM is closed, so I couldn't go through known crew member, like where the employees go through. I had to go through security, go back to the gate, and luckily my cell phone and my tablet was still there. So the gate agent was able to go back on the plane and get my, my stuff for me and I'm so thankful. So I'm walking back out of the exit to ground transportation to meet my crew now. So oh, crazy, I've never done that before. Good night, thank Good you. Night. Never left my cell phone behind or my tablet. I'm gonna talk to y'all when I get to my hotel room. Oh, y'all, just got to my room. <laughs> Can somebody please go down in the comments below and let me know how on earth did I leave my cell phone and my tablet on the plane. Like, let me turn the TV down because I know y'all can probably hear it. Left my phone and my tablet on the airplane. So I was trying to like talk to y'all about it briefly when I retrieved my belongings, but I was rushing trying to get back to my crew because y'all, I'm so thankful that I have a good crew. Like I love my crew. Shout out to y'all. Like if you know you know y'all know who y'all are like shout out to y'all i love y'all so much cat girl and donovan like y'all some real ones but um for real shout out to them for waiting my crew waited for me my my the flight attendants that are in my crew waited the pilots waited they all waited on the shuttle for me and y'all when we get to our layovers we are like our main priority and what is most important to all of us in the moment that we land at wherever we're laying over at is getting all the passengers off the plane, us getting off the plane, getting to the shuttle and getting to our hotel room so we can just relax and finally be off work y'all because we have been flying all day. So I was trying to tell you guys after I got my stuff back that my crew member Kat, she is so cool. Like we have gotten really cool on this trip together. We just vibe well and we get along so well and i just have really enjoyed flying with her she is a flight attendant youtuber so i am going to put her youtube channel up on the screen right now somewhere it's going to be on the screen where y'all can see it and i'm going to introduce you guys to her tomorrow so y'all will get to see her and i'm super excited for that and like i said um she's been vlogging this trip as well and i am going to be on her vlog so when you guys go check out her channel go check it out and look for your girl because i am going to be featured towards like the end of her vlog because you know we're like towards the end of the trip tomorrow's go home day but 
with all of that being said y'all your girl is about to finish watching this game get me a shower and get in this big comfy bed okay that is what i'm about to do i will talk to you guys tomorrow Well, we just landed back in Dallas and honestly today has just been like this last flight y'all already we were delayed but nonetheless we are here I told y'all yesterday that I wanted to introduce you guys to my crew member Kat, and I told them that you have a YouTube channel yes. and that it's all things flight attendant yes. life she is great guys this was an amazing trip I'm glad like it's over no offense. I know no, no, yeah. <laughs> no y'all I mean they already know they know yeah. Like when it's go home day, like we're tired. <laughs> we're ready to go, okay? Yes, yeah, so you guys, I'm going to again put her YouTube channel name up on the screen. Yes, so y'all can go subscribe and support my girl. And yes, y'all, y'all know I'm a commuter. Kat actually lives here in Dallas, so she's getting ready to go home. And we'll go catch the sky link. Yes, yes. Bye, it was so nice flying with you too. <laughs> We have come to the very end of today's video and I know that y'all are so sad that we are about to be parting ways, but I actually have some semi exciting news. I actually picked up a trip that leaves tomorrow morning. So I am in my hotel room right now in Dallas. Y'all know that I don't live here. So since I picked up a trip and I leave in the morning, I needed somewhere to sleep and I didn't want to sleep in ops. I am in my hotel right now and my trip tomorrow, you guys, leaves at 8 a.m. Our sign-in is at 7, we leave at 8. And we are going to 